Hello everyone, hello Alina. We're very happy to have you here today in our office. And Alina is here with some great news because she's just come back from Spain where she spent something around uh, like a month maybe and uh, she stayed there with her future partner. So we would like to ask her some questions today about her experiences. Um, Alina, tell us a little bit about yourself and why are you here? My name is Alina and uh, I am here because I got some very good recommendations about this agency and I really want to find a partner to build a family, so this is why I'm here. So why have you decided to become a client of a matchmaking agency? Uh, because my uh, relationships in Ukraine weren't really successful and what I've heard is that men from uh, other countries uh, are more family oriented. So what were some of the important factors for you when you were choosing the matchmaking agency? So the most important thing was uh, good communication and support from the managers of the agency and real communication with foreign men. So Alina, did you have any fears or insecurities when you decided to date a man from a foreign country? Well, actually, I was really worried about the communication, about how we would communicate with a, with a man and the language barrier, of course, because we don't know each other's language, but and with the documents and with my trip to a foreign country, of course, I had many, many fears. How did it turn out? Did Was there actually something to be afraid of? My fears were completely baseless and everything uh, turned out really well for, for me, my future husband, so just come, just uh, contact the agency and start to communicate. So we would really love to hear your love story, can you tell us? So maybe five months ago um, I started to communicate with this man and we, for maybe two, three months, we texted each other um, every day and we communicated a lot and then he invited me to come to Spain and this is when we first met and everything went really well and we got along and so now we are actually planning our wedding. So Alina, in your opinion, what is the main difference between uh, Ukrainian guys and foreign guys? Well, in my opinion, the, there is of course a big difference uh, in mentality and the way people communicate, but um, in, in my case, my man really wanted to create a family, so our relationships went really fast from, from the start to, to the next step to getting married. So, Alina, do you have any tips that you can give to those people who are also looking to find their match abroad? So, my first piece of advice is not to be afraid of anything, because I myself, when I first thought of contacting a matchmaking agency, I had so many fears and I thought that all those stories that I've heard about services like this is all just fairy tales and I didn't hope for uh, any good, good result, but because of the help and support from the managers in the agency everything went really really well and they um, helped me supported me all along during the uh, whole process of our communication with my future husband and so now what i want to tell you is do not be afraid and just come here and uh, see how it goes so were you afraid to go to spain for your first meeting uh, yes, actually I had a lot of uh, fears and doubts uh, about how everything will go, about the whole trip and how we will communicate with a man in a foreign country and I don't me not knowing the language, but uh, it turned out that all my fears didn't have any basis and everything went really well. Why in your opinion has your husband, your future husband, I shall say, fallen in love with you. I think it's because we have so much in common. It's because both of us want to create a family. We both want kids. And so it, it was very easy for us to communicate and the whole communication was very natural and very easy. So I think this is why. Okay, and why have you yourself chosen this man as your future husband? Because when I first went to Spain to meet him, he treated me in such a way to show me his respect, his love, his attitude. And uh, this is why I understood that this, this man really loves me and wants to have a family with me. So this is why. 
So thank you so much, Alina, for being here today and for sharing your experiences with us. Um, it's, it's really important. I can't really overemphasize how important it is to hear stories um, from our clients, our customers, when they come and share them with us because many of our future clients might have um, some doubts and fears and when people share their stories with us, um, I think it makes other people feel more confident about how this whole thing with um, matchmaking works. So thank you so much and if you could, it would be really nice and highly appreciated if you could s say a few words to the agency, like your wishes, your whatever, just a little bit of feedback to about the agency. I want to wish all the best to this agency and I really hope that you will uh, help other people, a lot of people find their, uh, find their soulmates, find their significant other. And what you do is very important. You uh, help people find their happiness. So best of luck.